Yo, what's going on ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today we are once again back on Modern Warfare and I wanted to share with you guys the best class setup for the new M13 diecast blueprint. Uh, this is a blueprint that's unlocked in the battle pass and I'm sure a lot of you guys have worked your way towards and uh, if you guys take a look at the attachments that come with the original blueprint, you'll see that this is an M13 assault rifle meant to play like an SMG. You'll see that the stats that we get, we get a nice mobility boost, we get a very, very small accuracy and range boost, but we end up losing control. And we can fix this to keep this an SMG type M13 and have better stats. So if you guys take a look at the uh, stats for the class setup that I'm going to share with you in this video, you'll see that we have uh, not only a really good mobility boost, but we get a really nice accuracy boost. Uh, we still get the same range boost and instead of losing control we actually get a little bit of a control boost as well uh, while keeping that SMG aspect of this M13 blueprint so if you guys take a look at the attachments by the way we're also going to be getting better aim down sight speed so for those of you that are wondering about that that is also a fact uh, but the muzzle that we're going to be using is the monolithic suppressor with this we're getting sound suppression and damage range uh, this is to give us a little boost to accuracy and range. We lose a little bit of mobility and control here, but we make up for that with some of the other attachments. The barrel that we're using is the Tempest Mini. We wanted to keep this the same. Obviously, this is what's giving it that SMG feel. With this, we're going to get aim down sight speed as a pro, which is really, really good. Also, movement speed. And we get a huge boost in mobility here. We end up losing accuracy and range. We lose a little bit of control, but we make up for that with our under barrel. Again, the Tempest Mini Barrel. The laser that we're using is the TAC laser, so again, we're getting aim down sight speed as a pro, which is great. Uh, we're getting aiming stability and aim walking steadiness, giving us a boost to accuracy and control to make up for that last attachment. And we're also getting another boost to mobility, which is really nice. Obviously, we want pretty high mobility with this being an SMG type AR, uh, so the TAC laser is the way we're going here. We're not going to be using an optic because we are going to be playing aggressive with this thing like it's an SMG. Uh, we're not going to be using a stock. The underbarrel that we're rocking is the Commando Foregrip. This is really to boost our control and accuracy back up. We also get a nice little range boost as well to get us in the green. We lose a very tiny bit of mobility here, but again, compared to all the attachments, this isn't really a big deal. Uh, so again, Commando Foregrip Underbarrel. And last but not least, the rear grip that we're rocking is stippled grip tape. Uh, this is a very important attachment if you're playing aggressive, especially uh, for an SMG type weapon. We're getting more aim down sight speed as a pro. We're also getting sprint to fire speed, which is really, really important uh, for when you're running around corners, running through doorways. It's going to be a great attachment to have, obviously giving one last boost uh, to our mobility. But I'll give you guys one last look at all the attachments and the stats that come with this specific class setup. Uh, if you guys have any questions about this specific class setup or the original blueprint, make sure to leave a comment down below and I'll be sure and try to help some of you guys out. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and I'll see all you guys in the next.